Awesome, Por ti yo cruzo en mi acarra, en bicicleta Y sin caminar le doy la vuelta a todo el planeta Me siento ganador y sin llegar a la meta What's going on guys? Welcome to another video Today I want to redo a past video that I had done about five things that I hate about my car I uh, pretty much got a lot of shit about that video because you know I guess people didn't think you know there were good points and now that I look back at it I think about the same thing that I didn't put that much thought into the video so I wanted to do it again and so here it is and I hope you guys can agree with more stuff on this one I've had the car for about seven months now and now I can I think I can finally see some things that really really annoy me and I hate and I wish this car would have been made a little bit more different so let's get to first it. first I want to talk about fuel economy on this car it is shit garbage total garbage all right I'm not even playing or, or anything I'm being legit uh, I have to put gas on this car now that I drive it daily since I got rid of my other car for work so this is you know, my only car and I have to put gas on this car about twice twice a week sometimes maybe three times uh, but no it, I'm not talking about you know letting it all get to you know the lowest level possible I'm talking about halfway and you know, then I fill it up I have to put like about 20 let's say about 40 40 dollars uh, a week that's if you know i'm not i'm not going out that much if i'm just going to work and you know just doing some uh soccer games and that's pretty much it but if i'm let's say i'm cruising around with friends and all that stuff then yeah i will be putting a lot more more gas into this car and that's just one thing that i really hate and now I see it, you know, like the competitors, they have, you know, Audi with A4, BMW with the 3 Series. They, I fear they put out a better MPG than this car actually does. So, that's the sad part about this car. Second thing that I hate about this car would be the brake system. The pads on, uh, you know, the brake pads, they are, you know, they, they work fine. They work actually, you know, pretty good. You know, I've, I've had some hard stops in this car and, you know, I haven't been disappointed in the brakes. The only thing that I really, really don't like about it is all the brake dust that they, you know, they emit. And it's just crazy. My front wheels, they are dirty, dirty all the time. They, they are dirty. Like, I can, let's, I can barely keep the wheels clean for about a day. And, you know, the front wheels, the back wheels, you know, it's fine. You know, they, all, they stay clean for the longest time. But... It is hard to, you know, keep the front wheels clean, you know, unless you do you clean them daily and even that, you know, they still they will still get dirty. So that is probably maybe a future mod that I'll probably do to this car, you know, change the brake system or or something, you know, just to keep the wheels a little more clean, but not, you know, uh, I don't want to give out performance, you know, brake performance, you know, stoppage power and all that stuff, you know. So and that's the second thing that I really hate about this car. On to the third thing that I hate about this car, and that would be storage wise, you know, center console and then the glove compartment, they're garbage. With the manual in there, you know, it's about yay thick and crazy. You can't fit anything in there. Just a little on the side, it has like a little, about a three inch space, you know, on width, length. I'm not sure, I haven't measured it and you know, I barely got like a mount in there, um, windshield mount, and that's about it. And you know, there's not much you can do. There's not, you got, you know, your cup holders on the doors, and that's pretty much it. You know, your uh, map, but nothing else besides that. Space uh, storage in the middle is tiny. It's it's about the same size as the cup holders, and I'm not even joking about that. And pretty much there's nothing on the back besides you know your cup holders on the doors and that's it storage is another thing that really annoys me about this car now but 
hey, I, uh, there's more things I love about this car than I hate, so it's it's whatever, you know. Fourth thing that I hate about this car would be uh, visibility in the back. The windshield is small, and then you got the big pillars on the side that, you know, that's a huge blind spot, but hey, you, sometimes you got to live with that stuff, right? But overall, you know, the car is perfect. You got the blind spot monitoring and all that stuff, but still, I would wish it had a little better visibility in the back and then the last thing that i hate about this car it's probably the, the you know the least important thing and that's the lighting in the inside of the car you know front back you got leds but in the in, inside is just them plain boring halogen bulbs and you know with everything that this car has you know the msrp of this car is about 45 i think i believe this was you know with everything that it has and for a car with this price to have halogen bulbs in the interior you know that's pretty much annoying to me that's something i will change but you know i just wish it came from factory with uh, led interior lighting but overall you know that's the, the five things that i hate about this car there are more things that i love than i hate about it and you know that's pretty much it guys so you know thanks for watching and if you agree with me on at least one of these things you know please give this video a thumbs up you know subscribe if you haven't and if you wouldn't mind share the video so the channel can grow and i can have more videos out for you guys i have a lot of things planned for this car and you know little by little i will probably you know one day have this car the way i want to so thanks thanks again guys for Watch this.